Welcome to our next video. We're talking about Markowitz portfolio theory and especially about capital market line. We have the following. Remember, we were talking about having share A and share B. They both have a risk. They have a risk measured by the standard deviation. Now we have a different, we have a third asset, the so-called risk-free rate, and it is risk-free. Let there be no risk at all for the risk-free rate, which means it has a sigma of zero. We can put it here. The risk-free asset, the risk-free asset can now be combined with the portfolio, with a portfolio of assets A and B. So which means we have A and B and a portfolio of A and B and we have a risk-free asset. And this free, risk-free asset is combined with the portfolio of assets A and B. Which means, which gives us the capital market line. And the capital market line is tangent to the efficient frontier. It is tangent to the efficient frontier and the point here, the point at which it is tangent is market portfolio. This is the market portfolio. Which means we have a separation theory. We have a separation theory which is very essential to the Markowitz portfolio theory. Which means that first of all we compute this market portfolio and then second and dependent on the utility function, on the utility of the investor, the investor either decides on lending or on borrowing, depending on his utility function. So first, first step is to compute this point, this point of tangency, and then second on whether to lend or to borrow. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.